hasn't been having some of the, the best plays that he has out west, and I think that's I think that's also a big part of that is he's got folks like Enan and Odin now that he has to go through. He's not running the show out there the way he used to. And, and that's the thing. I was talking to him before, Brad. I've, Boo Bear's uh, honestly been a sen one of my senseis, you know, one of my mentors, as you know, <laughs> Ty Lopez would say. Um, it's Smash. Talking to him about these young up-and-coming up and coming talents in the region, it's just so much fun uh, in, in his mind. So, actually, we're seeing Boo Bear start with something a little different here. He's been playing a lot of Rob today. Um, Paul Atana going to be the option du jour, at least for this game one, going to PS2. The house strategy, we see this all the time for Green Top. He's not putting the block out in that stream, and here we go. Boo Bear trying to get back safely, using the platform to land. It gets through the house, but Oda just too quick, turn around, getting his sword out. Boo Bear again, just like a lot of players do against Siege, just struggling to get in. Steve is not only getting mining his, his materials, he's, he's putting some damage on him while he does it. Right, and getting out of the corner with such ease there. Ridden air conversion going onto this left side. Dash back is so good because you can put off so many really fast options from ledge as Steve, so you, you want to get away. And let me make a, let me make a, a correction here. Onan, big Alex player, yes. actually. Whenever we yeah, whenever we uh, we see Onan on six, usually rocking the Alex, and Eden will usually play the Steve, uh, the two West Michigan homies. Oh I, I've been goodness. such a big fan of that. There's the block uh, above ledge height and the block below ledge height where they'll do up smash or forward smash. It looks so good every time. And huge damage to come off here. And yeah, opponents clearly not expecting it. Boo Bear was not expecting just the raw F smash. No. Just ran straight into it. Hard to get back up safely. And Down our little unsafe, not gonna find a punish for it. Short uh short hop nair into full hop back here. That was really nice. Back throw giving stage to Boo Bear. What do we got going on? Down so not gonna work out. Tricky movement coming off the corner there too to get that card out. Give some stage. Smart for Boo Bear to hang out a little bit, barely able to get back. Good run up. I, wow. was, I was expecting a grab, but no, he, he knew Boo Bear saw it coming. Good on him getting that up smash out. Now he has a two stock lead here. Oh, here's Big chain. I've been seeing this all day. The Steves have been like, placing blocks not under their feet so they can't continue these combos. I think it's a DI dependent thing where they get to follow it with the up airs and the jumps. Sometimes you might be able to get the block down. Ooh, I love that. Jump up slightly, get the, uh, the short hop nair out where you get the slight uh, sword hit. Go for stage, yeah. Keep your pressure. Keep your pressure on. If it's consistent, it's good. Wow, tough. He's Real tough. Yeah. Top of the swing. Comes off that bump button, using the iframe frame just to mine and back up. Puts the crafting table on the ledge there. Yep, a diamond sword out already. Oh, dancing. You said it right there, Craig. Yeah. That was beautiful. And a diamond online here, too. It's such low percent. This is dire straits for Boo Bear. Good, good catch from the no tech. Still getting. I thought we were going to see that smash come yeah, out. Me too, Boo Bear me thought too. we were going to do it. Tark pushing him back. Owns the stage. Yup, TNT. Not enough redstone to build out far, though. Get the button out. Ooh, teleport in, though, Boo Bear. Still fighting. Never want to give up. Always so calm. It's There's the same the thing. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's what I've been talking and about. I, that was a really strange interaction. In, be in between them was the up smash, and then through it was the forward smash. Yeah, cutting through the ray of yep. light, I suppose. Um, I don't know if we said this already. Best of five, start here, top eight. Yep. So a uh, little bit more room, a little bit more wiggle room uh, for these players to work with here going into these uh, these later sets. Start the battle. Ooh, the Rob getting uh, coming out here for what I would have to imagine is Boo Bear. Yeah, Alex going to be the choice again for Onan. Very, very nice. Going back to PS2 for this next one. Um, you know something I actually just noticed? Crafting table's already put down for you as soon as you start. You ever notice that? <laughs> no, no. You know, it's one of those things that's there, but like, it's just so minute. It's in the background. The more you know. Already reshuffling where the crafting table is, but Boo Bear doing a much better job to smother here. That's one thing that could be a problem for Boo Bear is that clearly the up smash from Steve is going to beat out the Nair from Boo Bear, from, from Rob. And that's one tool that Rob mains love is using that Nair to get back safely. Right. Ooh, laser gun, not gonna catch the roll. Going and out of there. Oh, 
setting the wall up, getting those, getting those, doing some mining. How did that, that down tilt not connect it? Right. Down smash has really been a really good option for Onan and Eden, to be completely honest. <laughs> the early parts of this bracket gets so many kills to the ledge, especially the Rob who likes to hover around the corner so much, uh, can really catch him slipping. Heal pressure put on, Bluebear holding it up, rolling back through, we got Diamond online now. Oh, the pressure over shield is really good by Onan. Uh, interesting option there too, getting the gyro online potentially, still gonna work out to a huge string here, my goodness. He'll try to find his way with that stock. Able to find it, doing things that Steve's gonna do. Hey, right. I'm just gonna push you back. I'm gonna make you approach me, and Gyro push, push him even further. Late parry, all right. The wall not gonna get knocked down as easily. Stone coming up. That's what I was wondering earlier. There's a lot of dirt, uh, but fully maxed out on stone and iron here in blocks for Onan. That's really good for setting up your fortress. Hey, th hey there you go. Diamond online here, too, in a very close two stock game. Oh, Gyro stalling out that forward air okay. attempt. Give me your air dodge. Yep. Yeah. And he's been looking for that one and tried it a whole lot today. And that was the first time. Dare I say it. the up B might have been a miss input too, with going directly to the side with an up B. Might have been trying to input a uh, side B to get card out, jump out a cart up B after that. He started out and said, dare I say, I thought it was about to be a down air. Oh, <laughs> uh, you've been you competing with Scooter too much. You, yes. you just got him with Scooter too. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> oh, dash tech not going to work here. Laser going to catch the high. Oh, want to wind up again. Give me this grab. Very nice weight. What gonna do with it? Oh, I thought he was gonna match out. He, he, he had really good match on that yeah. too. Honan, gotta get props. Get off this platform now. That up tilt's tough. You thought he was gonna throw it into the TNT. Yeah, yeah I, I know you wanted it. Yeah, good up there too. The double jump rising up there is really important to get because um, you, if you catch him while you're rising, Rob can use the up air multi to carry you higher and okay. make the DI much harder. Um, so that's why when you see a lot of Robs get that up air, it'll sometimes be stalling at like the very apex of your like you know, double jump. Um, very good thing. Able to get the kill much earlier. Going to game number two, one stock of, or sorry, one game apiece. Sorry, game number three, one game apiece. I can count. I'm happy with the light levels on the players too. I was worried about how dark oh, yeah. the players might look. They're looking, well, the screen's black. Oh, hey, there, there, we there we go, come on. Straight up Steve here. Right. Interesting. Three, two, one, go! Oh, the little bait on the <laughs> bait on the mining. I like that. Okay. Immediately jumps over the approach that Blue Bear put out. Um, going to Smashville here. Why might you think that Onu might want to go to Smashville? Using, well, I think he can use that platform just to create a little bit even more of a barrier in between him. If, you, if he put blocks up while you're on the other end of the stage, that's just one more thing you have to work on. Right. Putting the, uh, kind of an even bigger ceiling on your house. I, one thing I, I don't like this is one of the smaller oh. stages. I think that, that's one thing I wouldn't like this stage for if I'm owning too. You don't have as much room, you want too much space on the stage sometimes to retreat and get away and set up that house. It depends though. Oh, gets caught by the gyro, barely gonna die. But I'm thinking though, um, once you do get Blue Bear these higher percents, you're able to get a lot of knockback on the stray hits, which, uh, you know, Steve has great stray hits for big knockback. Um, you could find, like, you know, the breakups like this. There we go, good catch. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. You just get a one two hit, and then you have so much space to mine your materials. Might be able to stock himself up deep here. Catching with the up air, tries to find the laser. Wow, that oh. caught? No yeah, way. Yeah, are you kidding me? Ford air is still good for Monin. I was just about to say spot dodge through the card, but. <laughs> Caught yourself. Good job. Good shield. Wow. They're dancing close to each other, too, but not much hitting. Like, look at this. Yeah. Uh, I'm, I'm telling you, dude. They're, they're, they're doing a tango, but no one's taking damage. That was an interesting option. He buried him and found him. Want to knock up. Want to knock up off the. I did not know who was going to win that interaction. <laughs> that happened. Yeah, it's hard. Rob usually gets the benefit of the doubt, but against uh, yeah. Steve, it's tough to say. Ooh, got caught for the reach. Ooh, beat through Gyro there. Not going to catch a jumper in anything from Blue Bear. Very nice. I haven't seen much in the way from upgraded tools uh, this game. Great forward smash through wall. Good mix. Oh. Needed that one, too. He's down to his last time. Blue Bear still <laughs> two, two left. Okay, up to strings here. We're out. That's what I'm talking about. I mean, I need some better tools. 
Run, 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 run. Yeah, I need you. Oh! Yo! <laughs> we got it, boys. Double smack there. Up smash, no, looking for back air on a minion to jump. Oh, good catch. No, you're this is Rob. Yeah, yep, you can yep. fly. I know you have creative mode, but I have flight. Oh, yeah. See ya. That'll do it. That's a drop in game one. Blue Bear switches to Rob, Rob and is now looking a little bit stronger here. Takes the lead two games to one, heading into game number four. Yeah, makes you think what the Pally Picks was about. Was yep. about you know. But uh, nonetheless, uh, doesn't matter how you get there as long as you get there, right? Right. So it's working very well to get to the Rob for this game two and three. Uh, own it. Got to figure something out. Wondering a little bit here, they're staring down the barrel of seven. Could potentially see a character change come out. Uh, definitely thinking deep pockets. Yeah, definitely. Yeah. I don't know if you guys saw any earlier doubles or if maybe on sets own and played a little earlier on stream. Any of the other characters came out? Plays a really good Rob. Plays a really good Joker, Joker. too. But gonna stick strong with the uh, you know the character the palette swap. Here. I thought you were making another pun because you said deep pockets and he went by pockets for a while. <laughs> you said too much scooter. <laughs> too much scooter on your brain on your brain, man. Oh, love the flashing shield. I would find anything up the short up. Blue Bear's been aggressive. Every time he's been above the ledge, he's he's opted not to go bleed and grab. He's come over with a neutral air and you don't start to catch on to that. Right. Not finding much off of the uh, the short up jabs. There's that neutral air again. Get the shield down and Blue Bear has lived off the ledge this game so far. Right, right. And Rob has that luxury. I mean, I mean, people joke, and Steve has that luxury as well. Um, <laughs> honestly, but Rob, kind of the forefather of that. Yeah. What do we see here? Oh, the reflector. <laughs> I like that option. I never, uh, never thought of that. Nope. Double roll here. Synchronized swimming. So pressure not working till the third. The third time is a charm here. Up smash this. No. Can we go to the platform? Wow, it was winding something up. On and rocking gold here. Ah, again, yep. got caught for yep. standing on that block on the corner. Blue Bear finds the back air. Blue Bear says, catch me once, shame on me. Catch me, or what is it? Catch me once, shame on you. Catch me twice, shame on me. Not fall for it again. Another back air on approach here, too. Just coming in a straight line. My goodness, really? what a stock from Blue Bear. Oh, Onan can't believe it. Yeah, He's beautiful. looking a little flustered. Oh, got the footstool looking for the anvil drop there. That'll be a very good confirm. All right, all right. So that air mobility that Rob has. And Wood tools, man, I'm telling you. They'll kill you. Hey, the cart's metal, though. It'll be fine. <laughs> we need something here, though. Oh, we're, we're, hitting with our, we're mining with our hands. We're hungry out here. We need food. Yeah, these nair strings are hard to avoid. Able to jump out of one, though. Yes, there we go. Finally. Find me something here. Looking for these up tilts and up airs. An option. You know, he, Onan's been doing a good job. Every time he gets buried, I don't think he's really been caught with anything. Okay, big find here on the roll, reading the flat. Ah, Forder almost connecting. Starting to put something together. He's got he's to go pull this diamond drop. out. Got to yeah. pull this diamond out soon. And he, he's got to take Blue Bear's stock to keep this respectful. There you go. This is, the space, this is the space we need. Oh, has the diamond, though. Yeah, did not deny it. Oh, run those back airs. Up smash that. No, not going to get it too close. Very smart. The Nair can come out. Very possible here for Onan. More mats online just in case we have to build again. Not afraid to get in close. That's 30, damage. 40 damage. Again, block, yeah. block placement. Probably gonna, we're probably going to see more of that, you know, as, as more Steve meta develops. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Start people, people figuring some of this stuff out. Great back here, though. Onan putting up a huge fight. Oh, could get there here for the spot dodge. Jumps out of up air range. But there's an arm rotor coming. Look the patience by Blue Bear. Yeah, Blue Bear's so patient in the last hit. Onan definitely wants to take this now. Definitely wants to take this now. Yeah. Text the wall. Oh, boy. Yeah, diamonds are he's, he's, he's not big, letting big heavy body. Oh, that's broken though. That's crazy. Okay, no, no more pickaxe, no more back airs, no more fares. No. Diamond back though. 
Oh, which this trick all day. He's an yep. up tilt under the C. He's an up tilt under the C4. Yeah, but it's, it's scary. Stay, it's a scary go. Up. Oh boy. Oh my gosh. Yep, he avoided this. He was so focused on the C4, he wasn't ready to. Yeah. So good. Yeah. So good for Monin. Oh my god. And then Onan knew it. He knew the eyes were probably locked in the TNT. That was priority number one. Just right. trapped him straight into that up smash. What a way to finish it out. Going to game number five. And it's amazing too. I've seen. I saw that all day. Uh, a lot in doubles, especially in the two v one or the one v one situation, where he put down the uh, the plate, the pressure plate, and he put it on next to the TNT where it activate on up tilt, and it is a really big explosion hitbox. It, it's it's really cool. And he's uh, he's clawed his way into a game five here. Great set to start off this top eight. It's an arm song. Yeah. All right. Shout out. The throw here too, going for forward air. Wow, big, big. Get out of your car. I thought he was maybe down air that too, but a little scared to approach. Oh, not many grabs. Odin's been grabbing a lot more as the set's gone on. One thing we used to see Odin do quite a bit was use that um, down air too in, in neutral situations. And I, I don't know if. And I remember when they first started fighting Boo Bear and Odin, Boo Bear fell for it all the time. And I'm not sure if that just. Uh, a matchup development we, we've seen between the two of them since they played in West probably a few times since then. Boo Bear's gotten used to it, but we haven't seen it from him in all this match. Right. right. Oh, Cart gonna do it off the corner. Onan finds a foothold in his last game here. Oh, what a grab. Are you kidding me? When they say grabs can clank. They did not lie. He footstools out of arm rotor range. Oh, put him in the oh. dirt. Looking for a double four there. Yeah, we, can, we can fly. That's oh. what he was trying to do earlier. When he SD'd in, this, in the uh, earlier game in this set, that's yeah. what he might have been trying to do is the double cart and TNT stall. Uh, again, he even got recaught by cart there. That was a really bad situation. Slips out, though. Another arm rotor getting canceled by cart. What a landing. Oh, oh dancing. Try, try it again. Boo Bear's not falling for it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yep. Hey, Mike. Are you? Ooh, I thought he bit off more than he could chew there, but able to live. TNT falling off. Tool's broken here. What are we yeah, doing? The gyro sitting in front of his box. <laughs> <laughs> he doesn't want to craft anything here. I don't think he wants to waste diamond on this stock. So he's going to have to fight this one out with a little bit of handicap. Yeah, look at him. He's punching. He doesn't want to waste. His, he doesn't want to waste materials. Then he, he practically was asking to die. Yeah. There we go. Immediately, you know what the you know what the mojo is. Yep. But is that one stock too much to give Boob there? Onan saying no, it's not. Incredible. Running away from Cart. Tries to go off stage. Tries to set some up here. Uses the neutral and starts okay. something to forward air. Hey, we know what Rob can start though. You know, you right. know what we've seen. Oh, getting chased by these up airs though. Not gonna have to fly away. Might want to think about the resource. Trying to land aggressively though. Boo Bear wants to flip the disadvantage into advantage and a shield break here. What's the setup? Owning could be looking at game if he had to set up just the forward smash for some percent. he didn't have something more, but you know, it's, it's hey, we'll Steve, be fine. We'll be Steve's fine. not a shield break character often. It's probably not a setup he's used to. Uh, I don't know. There's there's probably some cheeky stuff out there, but we'll, we'll see uh, We'll see what it does. Still a great lead here, but a one-stock game. Still hard lead here. 106, 100, 100 point six, 26 here. Blue Bear, again, this is Rob. Okay. Oh, can we find anything off the tech? There, there's those I was talking about. I'm starting to bring them out now. Okay, card dude for you up smash. Bye. Gonna kill. Onan gonna bring it back from the jaws yeah. of defeat. Clutching victory. Beautiful game five win.